Hello, I'm Gaia Orion and here we are again for another stories and tips from my art career. You know when you're an artist, anything you create, especially like the last creation, whether it's like a painting, a drawing, or a little mud sculpture, it's like the most precious thing that that exists in the world for the artist. Before I became a professional artist, and I think a lot of artists do that, if you have to give a gift to someone who you really love, often we'll just like give them a piece of our artwork. It's kind of sad, but I'm completely aware that most of the artwork that I've given away as a gift, there's no way they were appreciated to the level that I felt they should have been appreciated. So one of the things that I did when I decided I'm a professional artist is I stopped giving away my art for free. I stopped giving it away as a gift. I think it's a decision that affects like a lot of other areas of me making a living with my art. Just yesterday I was talking to an artist who is just starting out and she just gave four days of her life to paint this beautiful giant mural for a local brewery where she lives. Now they said they only had money for the supplies, like for the paint. They didn't have money to pay her and I guess they assume that doing that big mural will give her exposure and she believed that doing this big mural was like building her portfolio. I think it's really sad, you have no idea how often us artists are asked to work for free or to give stuff away for free. And I'm not saying that we shouldn't do stuff for free or give away stuff for free, but I'm sorry, but like we have bills to pay like anyone. And I just don't, I just don't understand why people expect or think that because you're an artist, you can just come and have fun and paint something and just not being paid for your time. Like I would, like I would never like consider having someone come to my home and working for me for four days and just not paying them, just thinking like it's just okay. Or So here for today, please, if you need artists, find the money to pay them. You find money to pay every other professional in your life. Now, if you're an artist, please learn how to say that you are worth something and you will not work for free because every time an artist works for free and accept to work for exposure, we just like screwing up all the other artists. We just letting them know that, well, this is just something that is okay, that we can continue. It's kind of sad. It's like a society like without culture, without book, without painting, without museum, without opera, without theater, without poetry. Like we are the soul of humanity and we need to value that. And us artists, we need to value what we are offering. All right, so this is my speech for today. A little bit of a rant. If you're working for friends and family, maybe give them like a, a friend and family discount, but don't feel like you have to give it for free. If you're an artist that is making a living from your art or trying to make a living from your art, I'm 100% sure that you found yourself in that situation at least once. I certainly have. And it's okay, we're all learning. Let's just stick together. Let's continue to produce beautiful work, present it in the most beautiful way, and ask for what is worth for your time. Be confident that our contribution as artists, especially in those troubled times, is like so valuable and so important. And don't ever, ever doubt that. So if you want to talk about this a little bit more, join me at the next New Moon Zoom once a month. We'll get together a whole bunch of artists just to support each other in a creative journey and an art career. Thank you very much.